Welcome to my holiday 2012 workwear capsule. First up, I have McCall 6609, my current project. I was inspired by the color block method on designer dresses and the menswear fabrics used to make dresses on the runway this fall. Instead of using two solid colors, I love the idea of doing a solid and a mixed print or variegated colorways such as heather or tweed. I find that to be very interesting. I got this black solid and black beige wool rayon blend to give me the look. The next thing on my list is Vogue 1317. I saw a photo of this dress and I fell in love with the color. I had Vogue 1317 on my to buy list for a while because I love the A-line skirts and the bow without the excessive volume. This looks like it will flatter my pear shaped body type. I got this micro suede knit in a deep red. It's lighter in weight than I expected so hopefully it works out okay. I said that McCall 6550 would be my must have from the McCall's holiday line, but I was even more excited to make it when I saw a version of it on Mad Men. The actress had a houndstooth suit and the blouse was a solid with a houndstooth bow tie. All I could think was, I need that top. It looks so put together and polished. I'm going to use this chamoose combo to recreate the look using view A of the pattern. A top needs a bottom, right? The inspiration for the skirt came from my latest J. Crew magazine. The number two pencil skirt is a cult favorite for J. Crew aficionados because it's so flattering to most body types. The secret seems to be the length. It's 23.5 inches, so it hits about an inch below the knees, and it's tapered, making the legs look slimmer and longer. I'm going to use New Look 6003, View E for Mines, in this black suiting I picked up in New York last year. So, that is what's coming up in a review near you in the upcoming weeks. And I hope you're planning something special for your holiday events. Stay tuned.